everybody. Um, this is a video about New Year's resolutions and how there's been a bit of hoo-ha about them recently. Certain people thinking they're above the level of New Year's resolutions. Other people thinking they're a great thing. Uh, oh, by the way, yeah. Turns out my mum watches my YouTube videos because she bought me this T-shirt for Christmas. That was nice of her. Uh, yeah. New Year's resolutions, and I think they're quite a good thing. Um, a lot of the cynics are saying, well, people don't keep them. You know, everyone says they're going to do more exercise or eat more healthily or whatever every year, and every year they don't keep it. Um, but I mean, so what if people don't keep them? I mean, even if someone only spends the first couple of months of the year getting more exercise or eating right or whatever else, that's better than nothing. And even if they have said it five years previously, even if every year they keep setting the same resolutions, you know, who's to say this year isn't the year they're going to make it? You know, as the saying goes, if at first you don't succeed, you try again, don't you? So I don't really have a problem with the fact that people make New Year's resolutions or that they make the same ones again and again and again. You know, it really doesn't matter. Um, I already do quite a lot of exercise and I'm... I like to think I eat fairly healthily. I could probably stand to tidy things up a little bit here and there with my diet. But, you know, overall, I'm, I'm a vegan. I do weight training and stuff like that. I am looking to get back into martial arts this year. That's something I'd quite like to do. Because uh, I've still been keeping fit, but I haven't um, done martial arts training for a while. It's been a, probably about a year since I did any. Um, but it's a case of finding the time. Just making sure I've, I've got the time to do it. Uh, that I can commit to it properly and so on um but yeah that's one of that's maybe a new year's resolution possibly uh the m main ones i've got are quite, are quite ordinary uh one would be to try and keep a bit more organized in general now yeah this is probably one a lot of people make and they probably all fail at it but again even if it's just for the first few months of the year you manage to be a bit more organized that's better than becoming even less organized isn't it so I think it's quite a good thing, it's quite a good time of year to choose this sort of thing. And so yeah, I've got to try and make sure I tidy things up a bit more, keep on top of things I should be keeping on top of a bit more. Um, you know, in some, I've found in some areas of my life, I, I used to, uh, I've been quite organised, it's just others that I tend to let slip. Um, but yeah, so that's what, that's what I think there. The, the thing some people have been saying is, they've been saying, well, why why New Year's? You know, it's an arbitrary time of arbitrary time of year to pick to do new to, to do a new resolution. Um but I mean whatever time of year you pick is gonna be arbitrary. You know, there is no time of year you can pick which is an actual actual definite best time to, to start. Um the fact that it's traditional around this time of year to make resolutions, I think is quite a good thing because it means we feel like we're all in this together. We know we're not the only person who's trying to turn their life around in some way, be it big or small. We know we're not the only one doing it. And it does give us a sense of being being in it, all in this together, which is quite good. So I think that does help boost us a little bit. And, you know, I, I do agree with what some people have said, that when you make a New Year's resolution, you should try and not make too many and... Or if you're going to make a lot, try and make them small things, things that are easy to accomplish. Or if, if you've got a really big thing you want to get over, try and just maybe focus on a couple of things. So maybe a couple of quite, if they're very big changes you're trying to make in your life, make it just a couple. Uh, don't have a huge list of unfeasible goals, because you're probably not going to achieve them. And when you don't achieve them, you're going to feel really bummed out. You're going to feel really sad and you're going to feel like a failure, which, you know, in reality, what you did was you set a load of tasks that you were that were unrealistic. So those are some of my thoughts. I don't see a problem with New Year's resolutions. I think they're a good thing. If you don't keep them, well, there's nothing really wrong with making them again next year. Maybe after a few years, you might actually find you start keeping them, or you keep them a bit longer the next year, and a bit longer the next year, and a bit longer the next year. And the point is, it's worth a try. If you don't succeed, try, try again. Brilliant. So thanks for watching, everyone. Take care. Let me know what you think. Goodbye.